What's up everybody, it's your boy Ryan, and this is the Thunder Channel on Nootropics. So a lot of you are interested in kind of like what I'm doing outside of Nootropics that are supplement related. And I'm gonna talk about two new supplements that have been in the mix that so far I feel like have given me some cardiovascular benefits. And generally, um, what, what feels to be a little bit increased microcirculation, brain blood circulation, and also stronger erections, um, which is interesting. And I think both these are contributing to, to that. Number one is, Total Beats, Total Beats, sounds like a, like a Dr. Dre album or something, um, by Force Factor, no affiliation. It's basically just beetroot powder and betaine nitrate. Uh, for those of you into nitrates, it's NO3T. And I take a scoop of this, which is seven grams total. Uh, it's about six to eight ounces you know, in total, and put it in water and throw it down. There's some stevia in it, so it you know tastes fine, makes your spit red. Um, it could make your pee red. It could make everything that it comes out of your body red, um, which you got to understand, like, <laughs> like if you start eating beets and then your stool is red and you're like, what the fuck's going on? It's the, <laughs> it's the beets. You got to be like conscious of that. Otherwise you scare the shit out of yourself. Um, so that's supplement number one. I'm taking again, um, yeah, seven, seven grams of it, you know, right in the morning just before I do a mile and a half walk uphill around my neighborhood. I feel like it maybe helps the walk a little bit, helps my brain during the walk. I have a pronounced brain clearing effect that is both attributable to getting, you know, some s slow, steady state, very slow, steady, steady state cardio, um, but also I think to the to the beat product. I think beats in general for, for blood flow and microcirculation are, are important. I mean, these are things, like I'm just into that sort of stuff. Right, like aside from the nootropics thing, like what can I be putting into my body that just makes me live longer and makes me feel better, you know, and makes me makes me makes my physiology work really good. So the other uh, something that I added recently, which I, I have been obviously paying attention to, and a lot of folks have been talking about it for many years, is is, is collagen peptides, collagen peptides. Um, so collagen is is. Uh, to say the least pervasive in the human body and human physiology. It is like primary, you know, one of the primary kind of repair, uh, you can't really call it a chemical, you know, chemicals because it, it's it's chemicals, right? You know, collagen is made up of a lot of different uh, things, not the least of which is your typical amino acid profile. Um, and, you know, but it's, it's touted as or purported as effective for enhancing the look of your skin by just making your skin look better and less wrinkly over time. I would imagine that, you know, if you actually have substantial wrinkles, you'd have to be taking it for a serious amount of time to, to notice visible benefits. But um, hair growth or hair health, nail health, and then importantly, joint function. Now, I don't have joint issues, but I do notice that like, so I was doing this, you know, morning walk prior to starting taking both of these supplements, but particularly the collagen peptides. And I don't want to say that my knees hurt, but there's a little bit of discomfort because I live in a neighborhood of a lot of hills. So it's very hilly. It's like almost an in super incline for a good bit of the walk and then a decline. And then decline walking down a hill can hurt your knees, right? So there was a little discomfort. Since I've been taking the collagen peptides, I haven't had that discomfort. Is it really the collagen peptides? Hard to exactly tell. Uh, based on what it should be doing, probably. That's what I would say. Um, and that's it. These are the two supplements that I've been fussing with recently that I think are really cool. This is, Vital Proteins is kind of like the main brand that like if you go read about collagen and um, good brands, a lot of companies that are writing about it or blogs that are writing about it are, are pointing to Vital Proteins, which is a, a good quality grass-fed and pasture-raised um, collagen peptide supplement. And then, um, yeah, and then Total Beats. Uh, I, I just, this, this here aside, along with vegetable juice, like a good quality mix of like cucumbers and chard and lettuce and uh, grapefruit and celery, like in a, in a, in a, in an actual juice with no concentrate and no bullshit, no other bullshit in it is a great, uh, you know, supplement, if you will. It's really like a juice drink to have for microcirculation, general health, cellular functional health, 
uh, uh, you know, oxidative stress reduction, things of that nature. I think the beetroot has some overlap too. Um, and these are the kind of supplements that, that I'm, that I'm really into these days, right? Aside from nootropics, I mean, nootropics take the baseline that you can achieve from doing stuff like this and just substantially sort of skyrocket it to really wherever you want to go in terms of brain productivity. You know, the, these, these things here won't really increase, uh, you know, at least to a large degree, your brain performance output, but you know, that's where, <laughs> that's where nootropics come in. But these things are really pretty awesome. So those are the two that I've been supplementing with recently that I'm kind of experimenting with and just trying to give some time to see where the real benefits are. Oh, did I mention I didn't, I don't think I mentioned that the collagen peptide supplement has uh, given me harder erections. It's given me stronger EQ. Now, some would say that you can attribute that to the beet powder and sure, it, it is a trip, it should be attributable to enhanced blood flow. But I was taking the beet powder before I was taking the collagen peptide. Six days or so before, just straight beet powder. And then this stuff came in from Amazon. And I was not experiencing a noticeable shift in EQ. Collagen peptide comes in and there is a noticeable, noticeable improvement in, in general EQ and spontaneous erections, which is interesting. So I went and researched a little bit about it and figured out that the corpus cavernosa, this kind of muscle tissue in the male junk, is heavily influenced by collagen. Um, and over time, uh, you, you effectively lose collagen quantity and signal function in the junk over time as you age. And there are a lot of conditions that can bring that on, like general ED caused by whatever. There's probably some sort of issue with collagen um, in that. Um, obviously, the, the, the overarching problem is, is, is blood flow, etc. And in some, some cases, neurotransmitter firing and stuff. So um, I hope that's been helpful. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. Today, what's today? God, I, I lose track of days because I just kind of days blur together. Tuesday, I think. Today's Tuesday. We're going to do some content in Cortex Lab based on some experiments that I've been doing lately or interacting with that I can't wait to put up later. Um, special secret projects still in the works. Moves being made. So much more to come on that. I mean, it's going to literally change the game in the Neutropics community. It's going to be really cool. So I'll keep you guys posted on that. Otherwise, um, we're still running Cyber Monday, Black Friday specials, 15% off everything at livecortex.com. Just use the coupon code 1515. So if you want to go get products, whether Cortex Stack, Nootropics Ground Zero, Nootropics Masterclass, VTP, even the consults, the three and a half month and the six month consults, you can get 15% off of them right now, which actually will save you a substantial amount of money. Uh, so you can think about pulling the trigger on those. Use that coupon code, but you have to do it now because that's ending in a couple of days. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. Talk to you next time.